one, oh, you know, this is like one side, and let's see if, oh, just ready. Back in November, um, I was emailed an opportunity from the Science Museum in Oklahoma City to have the opportunity to apply for a workshop. Uh, the workshop was being put on by the Science Museum and Boeing of Oklahoma City. Once we went to the workshop and completed the two days, we were able to receive material to bring back to our building to use, and then we were also able to apply for an outreach, which this is what is here today. We're really hoping to be able to kind of provide teachers with resources and kids with sort of a fun, hands-on uh, approach to science because a lot of kids, some kids don't like science because they think it's not fun. Students love hands-on things, real-life experience, and I think this is quite very appropriate for the elementary level. Science, technology, engineering, it opens a door for them even later on in life like oh this could be a career I could do or I was interested in that. I remember in third grade we talked about being an engineer you know and keep that going with the science and math. It's based off um, electricity so we're kind of working on some simple circuits with them, just basic circuit, making a circle with a battery and some wires and getting like a light to work. They are just amazed that they can be given a Christmas light and uh, put the wires up to a battery and it lights up. They get to be creative, uh, kind of brainstorm and uh, troubleshoot ways to sort of build a machine that will take a ping pong ball across the table using a uh, battery and their motor and just kind of working with physics and electricity that way. I did not know you can do this with science. How cool is this with science? Awesome. So far this morning when I was in here, a little girl ran by, she said, this is the best day. So she was really excited. They, I just think uh, getting out of the classroom, the normal classroom setting is important for kids. They can get up and move and get their blood flowing and their brain going and they just get really excited about it. We're wanting to make sure that our students uh, realize it's not just about reading, it's not just about math, it can be about science, technology, it can be about designing. Uh, find those other students areas if math and reading is their weak area, maybe science, technology, or engineering can be a focal point that can help them be more motivated in school.